A delta robot consists of three arms connected to universal joints at the base. The key design feature is the use of parallelograms in the arms which maintains the orientation of the end effector. Delta robots are commonly used for grasping and packaging in factories because they can be quite fast. Some weeks ago I saw a video of a little delta robot and I was intrigued by the complexity of the movements that it could make despite its simple structure. So I thought I'm going to make one. Also, I thought it would be interesting to be able to control it using an iPhone, taking advantage of its accelerometer. I decided to use an Arduino microcontroller to control the robot via USB. I decided to program the Arduino to read open sound control serial messages and I programmed an interface for the iPhone which reads the accelerometer's data and sends them to a server application via the open sound control messages. When the server receives them, it calculates the inverse kinematics and sends the joint angles values to the Arduino. The angles are used to drive the motors. Now let's see how it works. Taking the iPhone in my hand, I can move the robot controller up, down, left, and right. I can also change the height with the slider here, my thumb. Now let's try to draw a circle. For the inverse kinematics, the user rotates and moves the iPhone to set the end effector's desired position. It is necessary to determine the corresponding angles of each of the three arms, the joint angles, in order to set the motors and thereby the end effector in its proper position for grasping. When moving the end effector, one can see on the server screen a corresponding image which shows the position of the end effector as described inside this triangle here. So, taking the iPhone, the user can move it how they choose, and on the screen, we can see the corresponding position. I also connected an LCD monitor to the Arduino microcontroller in order to display the joint angles in real time. 